Um, it's the morning of the second day. It's very early. You should put Vaseline on your thighs. <laughs> you should probably put it on for me. Yeah, how come I have to wear the banana suit and nobody else did? The way we're going, I couldn't figure out how to use that thing, so I couldn't tell like which way if we're going north, south, east, west, northeast, southeast, south, west, east, and north. I think Eminem makes a way hotter chick than I do. What about me, man? I thought I was pretty hot. You're you're pretty good with the ass like, hanging out. Like I like butt that. Crack. Yeah. Chicks love when like a dude's butt cracks just totally hanging out of the pants. I think pretty much anything Eminem does is cooler than what we do. It's because you have a crush on her. So? It doesn't change the fact that he's cool. I don't like me, and no, I don't know you don't like me either. I don't know if you saw all the sex that just walked by. What do you have to say about me not having the sound turned on for the first hour on the, on the, on the camera? <laughs> Turn on the sound. Yeah. And, uh, have you shot anything in the last three hours, you think? No. I tried to walk in the bar right now. Yeah, they wouldn't let me in. They wouldn't let you into the club? Uh-uh. Why not? I don't know. They said I, I didn't have ID because I don't have my wallet with me, so they can't, I can't I can't go in there. And I said, well, we have, we're have we filming a video. He said, no, you're not. Yeah, how come I have to wear the banana suit and nobody else did? You like that uh, idea? It's that last one. And the first one. Okay. It's the timing of the first one. Cool. Not so good. Get me. How did we get through? I think it's time that I should leave. I think it's time that I think it's time that I should leave. Injection of love from the erection. My best thing, thing, my best friend thinks I'm just humping guys. He's right. All night long. And then there's something very wrong with my dick. And I know my dick needs to get laid. It's been hard since yesterday. I like to hump guys. I like to hump guys. Thank you.
Do it, do it, do it, throw it hard. Yeah! yeah. Woo! Yeah. Fuck it! That's my fucking shit! <laughs> hey, mom, there's something in the back of it. Injection of love from the erection. My best thing, thing, my best friend thinks I'm just humping guys. He's right. All night long. And then there's something very wrong with my dick. And I know my dick needs to get laid. It's been hard since yesterday. I like to hump guys. I like to hump guys. Thank you. How you doing? We're here in Cincinnati. Here we have the schedule for tonight. Hey, website. I'm Jimmy. I'm Prickby Mafia. Yeah, yeah, say it. Like, put your band on there. I'm Prickby Mafia and from Cincinnati, Ohio. What are you going to do? Gonna play a song in your found glory. <laughs> <laughs> Cincinnati WKRP fucking show the very hot outside but there's a very pretty there's very pretty scenery there there is very pretty scenery back there hi my name's Tom <laughs> 69 love you so much <laughs> <laughs> Girls are crazy. Who am I? Some girls are crazy. Listen to what <laughs> I say about it. We were talking that we wanted Jordan to make a his finger an extra long, just like a, just like a little bit creepier long, so it looks all big from the back. So we kind of go like this. So you got like a witch finger? Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, how'd you like playing with Newfound? It's fun. Yeah? Fucked up a couple times. But you know what? We didn't like it better, though. I didn't like it better. You didn't like it any better. Are, are you going to do it again? Hey, yeah. man. Newfound can fucking keep them. Newfound can keep them. I'm looking for a new bass player. Some girls are crazy. What's up, baby? Get back. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. My God. I just turned the heater on for you guys. So that's all right. How you doing, man? Good. You excited? Yeah. 
excited to play? Always excited to play. Nice. stuff on the lawn just so y'all know okay if i come to you i might come to brian and say hey just in case we might might, might want to take a pause on the show if anything gets too crazy okay yeah i don't want people getting hurt exactly so. don't want people getting hurt want everyone safe everyone go home with two arms two legs and two dicks two balls this time bud <laughs>
to see me golf real quick? Yeah. I'd say throw just how Mark did it, right on the ground. and you're listening to KDWB. Check it out. Well, the going, how this... You know, we love doing videos, but it's not the why we join a band, to be sure. You know, I mean... Thank you. Yeah, exactly. Well, I think a lot of people try too hard to make themselves be, like, super cool or super badass in their videos, and we just, you know, we just want to have a good time. Gonna go meet the kids. Hello, hello. Oh, shit, I almost fucking fell down the stairs. Oh, you guys all ready? <laughs> yeah. Of the one, the shoulder you've been crying Cheetah, Jimmy? Cool, man. Very nice to meet you. Thank you. I'm so excited to do this because uh, I love those guys. Uh, you know, they're uh, something sexy about them, you know, and uh, I'm totally, you know, heterosexual. Uh, but uh, as much as, I mean, if I ever was, if I ever was gay, I mean, I'd be like, they'd be your boys. So I'd be sticking my hand down to Mark's pants, you know. Uh, me and Travis almost made out close. Yeah. I mean, not really. I mean, I was in the front row. He was like, maybe, you know, 500 feet away from me or whatever. But it was close. It felt like I was going like, I was like, 
So what you're saying is Mark is more attractive than Tom? Well, Tom I say for later. You know, oh, I he's like the after dessert. show. Yeah, it's like yeah, it's like the yeah. Mark's <laughs> like the appetizer. Travis is like the meal. Right, right. And then you know, do you feel like dessert tonight? Yeah. Oh, I guess so. What's what's on the what's on the menu? Oh, Tom. <laughs> Tom DeLong. Oh, that's cool. You know, yeah. Tom the short, by the way. I love you, kids. I love talking to you. I love seeing you. I love everything about you. So Funny. there's gonna be probably about what twelve thousand people out there. Is that what it is? I think around there. Wow. Have you have you, you know, have you done this in front of that many people? I haven't done it in front of that many people. No, <laughs> you're gonna so be this scared. Like, you're this is my scared. first. Uh, this is my first thing. I don't care. It's like this is gonna be. Come fun. on, seriously, on a scale of one to ten, how nervous are you? I, I'm constantly. I'm always on a ten. I'm always. <laughs> I don't think I've ever not nervous. All right. Wait, two. Oh, oh, son of a biatch! You know? Strike two. Strike two. One, two. Yes! Yeah! No! Yes! No! It's the only clue! I knew I was gonna do it, I swear to uh, God. I knew I was gonna do it. It's fucking awesome. Do the best. Thanks so much. Uh, relax, Sheeta, and enjoy the hey. show for once. You know? We enjoy the like show. You. Horrible. Cool, man. Well, you'll have a good night, and if you don't, then ha ha to you. Ah. <laughs> Kids. I love talking to you. I'm gonna ride on some roller coasters today because they're fun. Uh, we get the front of the line. Yeah, and we go to the front of the line. Very lucky. Thank you. God. Did you just thank God? I thank God. That's right.
comprimir. We're here at St. Louis. I have yet to come out of the venue. It's our first time out in the venue. Ever? Ever. On this tour. I remember we played the Warp Tour here. Our stage was set up right over here. Ice T was over there talking about how you can buy uh, guns off his website. <laughs> we were over here talking about how we want to see boobs. How does that make you feel right now? Solid zit right there. <laughs> Solid zit, and they're going, holy shit, who look at so fucking ugly? On a scale one to ten, what would you rate this guy? A Tom. A ten? Well, if you said anything else, then it would be bad. I hurt my feelings. And yeah. Do that, you know? What are you guys here to see? Tom? No, no, no. no, 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 no. All right, that's a good, a good answer. That was right. All right. The second question would be, uh, you guys having a good day today so far? Yeah. <laughs> okay, the third question is, what do you really feel about uh, Congressman Condit and his like missing intern business? Do you really think the Republican Party and the GOP are trying to repress the Democrats? <laughs> How's your day going? Talk to me about so your day. So far, so good. You know, really? today I woke up, Yeah. got up, fucking hung out, and did nothing all day. Freedom! No, no one could catch us. Freedom! <laughs> Don't walk on that grass in the hill. Oh, okay. Uh, He's, uh... No, he was driving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It was just oh, okay. right here. Go on the grass right now. Do it, do it. Go on the grass. Should we go on the grass? Go on the grass, go on the grass. Go on the grass. We went on the grass! We went on the grass! Hey, that's fucking punk. That we're is We're going on the grass. He told me not to go on the grass. I the first star I see may not be a star. You guys feel as though you need to repent any sins while here? <laughs> The main to this room, right? The door's locked. So I pull it, it's locked, right? And I let go, and I walk out, I'm looking, and all of a sudden the door shakes that I just was at. I swear to God, it went like this. Like that. I swear to God, dude. I swear to my life. And maybe someone wants to come out. Hey, this isn't very ambiguous, is it? Hey, dude, what's your name? What movie? Let's look at Travis's new tattoo. It's not done yet, man. It's not done yet, but he's all messed up. What do you think about tattoos in general? Fuck, they look right on Travis. They, they wouldn't look right on me, though. You don't think? Get a Bro. pen and draw some shit right here, and we'll see if you think it looks right on me or not. Can I write, I love me? All right. Yeah. Then you can go to press with it. What's going on? What are we waiting for? Hey. Hey, Brian. Hey, I put deodorant on all day. But... Yeah. <laughs> I probably should have tied that up. My two zits are almost, almost gone. Oh, my God. Almost you know, all the way gone. Those are probably ingrown hairs, huh? Sure, bug bites. They're probably not zits. They're probably ingrown hairs <laughs> or bug bites. Uh-huh, for sure. What, uh, what's next on the list of duties for Blink-182? Meet the, meet the people, meet the press, meet and the then press. I got this fucking awful video game that I'm stuck on right now. It's called Escape from Monkey Island. You think that there's more that you could do in your spare time than play video games? You think there'd be more that you could do in your spare time than put cameras in people's faces and annoy them? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
That hurt deep, man. You got here's the key to my bus. Bam. How do you do it? Which bus is yours? Oh, you can't see it. You can't see it. It's it's the best one out here. We're doing some vocal warm-ups here. We're doing some warm-ups. Uh, uh, give me an E. You can sing. Not bad. Thank you. Thank you. you can hold a note. That's all you need to do to sing. <laughs> all right. Sing one of our songs. Here we go. Um, fuck it. Sing it. wonder looking to get rich I'm not trying to sell out my soul I was here before they exploited our scene I'll be here when they're dead and fucking gone I think Tom wants to like hit someone or something <laughs> the time oh shit are you guys nervous you guys are nervous so thousands and thousands of fans. This is my new song, it goes like this. I know I got a really nice butt. Bus and they're ready to play here in uh, Dallas, how Texas. Teeth? How my teeth? They're a little yellow. Oh. <laughs> I got them. Ew. Dude, I'm gonna have some fucking crazy phone sex to our machine right now. Watch this. Okay. Get the tongue ready. Please hold while the next hell subscriber you are trying to reach is located. Why do they do that? Because they're assholes. Hi, honey. Uh, just getting ready to go on stage. I want to say I love you. And uh, well, really, I was thinking about your boobs. And uh, just like I think you got great boobs. And um, I love the way your butt looks. And I love you when you're naked. Um, every once in a while, I lather myself up with soap. And I think about you when you're hot and slimy. Ah. By the way, Cheetah's filming this. So this is on the internet. <laughs> say hi, Jen. Hi, lover. Okay, we're Ooh, going to play a show, baby. Wish me luck. I love you. Bye. Until the humidity comes back. Right. Until I'm sweating, my first drop of sexy perspiration, the show will not start. Okay, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you something. I'm gonna show you something. Look what God did. Look what God did when he was mad. So mad. He goes, I strike under thee the ugliest individual with the wrath of a thousand flies from a thousand camels. Bad religion. <laughs>
Jumping up, and right when you come down, you hit the ground. It's all it could happen. It might happen tonight. If it did, would you would you keep it a secret, or would you express your diarrheaism to the crowd? Everybody has diarrhea. Everybody. It's a natural thing. Uh, so I probably have to share it with everybody. Yeah. What I do is I take a towel, and wipe my butt with it, and I throw it out oh, into the people that I didn't like. I would give you a hundred dollars if you did that. I throw it at you on the side of the stage. <laughs> How do you like your scooter? Since we got the dog, but the scooter's uh, kind of gone by the wayside. Of, I'm oh. gross, dude. I'm what do you mean, dude? Your neck's still hurt. Skin. I'm rough. Your neck's still hurt. You're still kind of stiff now. Yeah, I'm still stiff. How, just from the tattoo? Really? No. Sar, I can't do that. Hey, get it on film him denying his fans. Oh, yeah, yeah. Good job, dude. No. It's only you. Fuck Fuck you. Because watch Travis. That. Travis is going to go. Yeah, oh. Go up there and oh, you just got eliminated, no, it's dude. It's not that. In Houston, Texas, and we're on our way to um, go visit Dr. Brian. He's the family doctor for these guys. They have problems and um, Are they? they need a doctor. Arr. Arr. Matey. Look at, mm. I think you're getting a bald spot on your nuts. <laughs> oh. There's air conditioning in here. Oh. So Tom, you want to go first? Yeah, yeah. I gotta go get a mirror and stuff. So. And I'm gonna drop. You, you yeah. would you prefer? Yeah. I'd rather scope you. That's yeah, do it all. That's a good one. Fuck. Press it in Stop further. So <laughs> bias your brain. Ah, hang on, hang on. Does that feel good? Dude, he's stuck it in like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting irritated nose too. Oh really? Mm -hmm. What does that mean? I don't know. I, give, I got some flunies for you. Let's start using it. Fix it. In the, <laughs> in the bag of tricks. You brush your teeth, that's pretty good. Swallow and squeezing your esophagus, dude. I'll just spray really locally in your nose, so it shouldn't affect anything at all. Okay. Not even a little bit. There's a 1% chance half yeah. your face will go numb and you'll lose feeling <laughs> <laughs> forever. I'll say that. <laughs> oh my god! So actually, how does it feel? <laughs> it numbs your nose. Get all this on film. It's like your nose is down the yeah. back of your throat. It's like your vocal cords. <laughs> so it, it numbs your gag reflex. Let me give you a tiny little spray of the numbing stuff, okay? Right. So it doesn't affect your voice. No, yeah, whatever. Sniff it back. Yeah. It's a little bitter tasting, but. Oh, 
take a shit. Really? Really? <laughs> Good? Oh, Good ears? His ears are cleaner than your ears. Oh, oh my god. Really? That guy did. Tell me if I hurt you, okay? You know, that's what you did. You're doing great. You're doing great. Tom. That's the worst part right there. Take a shuttle one time. Take a puff up your cheeks and release one. Pull the air. You're out here in the operating room. You're about to size. You go, this next one's for all the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Mark in his my fucking badass pajamas, dude. These are what kind of pajamas are these? These are Neiman Marcus pajamas that I got today. Believe it or not, these pajamas cost two hundred and fifteen dollars. <laughs> oh my god! Now you're really gonna. This is what you're actually gonna wear to sleep. Like you're gonna sleep in this. You know what's gonna happen is I'll fucking I'll wear them for like I'll wear them to bed twice and then I'll fucking never You'll wear them again. Them. Yeah. <laughs> friends and um, we shall be back tomorrow with more good stuff right yeah hell yeah all right shit more shit tomorrow dude we're not even halfway done you little right. bitch shit say good night good night yeah all right good night good night sleep well <laughs> little night. kids bye hey people this is cheetah and it is august 14th we're here in boise idaho link is sound checking you can hear it in the back Hey mom, there's something in the bedroom. So here's your Travis walks up to people, he goes to the mall every day, walks up to random people, goes, know who I am? Oh yeah. <laughs> Dead serious true story is like one o'clock in the morning, my phone rings. <laughs> I'm asleep in bed, I pick up the phone, oh, who the hell's calling me at 1 o'clock in the morning, I hear all kinds of people screaming in the background, it's Tom, totally drunk with like five of his friends, and all I do is go, you got big balls, and they all <laughs> crying, they're laughing so hard, they hang up. It's true, I don't know if I have big testicles or not, because I don't go around looking at other guys' testicles, sure. but the research that Tom has done, his familiarity <laughs> with the male testicle, he, he has the uh, I like, experience. I, I take a very hands-on approach to my, uh, <laughs> my stuff. <laughs> Everybody, put your, put your thing on. Oh, oh, shit, Travis. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> you know what else? Oh, man, you, if you get in last place, Travis, I'm going to be so fucking disappointed. Because <laughs> it's like... Fucking gross, dude.
something wrong, this is gonna shock them. Nothing to do. Oh, 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 o
I have a diploma. I, I got a diploma. I have a diploma. Got a video. You got to make sure you eat lots of food. Didn't get busted all by some. Blast! Alright, a couple weeks ago, there's a fucking manhunt around this whole block. They um closed down all the streets around here. There's a manhunt and shit. This was crazy. Really? Yeah. They were after you? No, not, not, not us. <laughs> Cheetah. Come on, seriously, are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. I like peanut butter, dude. This stuff is the fuel for life, right here, mom. Deodorant. Oh my lord, who did that? Because Tom forgot to put it on today. <laughs> This is Christine. She works with international apartments. She makes us go very far away. And do lots of work. And do lots of work. Because she wants us to sell records.
Hi. Okay. Hi. Hi. I'm filling out my Taco Bell application. No way. Taco Bell application. No, now, Other now names you you've used. Other names you've used. Cricket. Don't call you the exact same time. How do you spell cricket anyway? C R I C K E T. Doing this left handed. How long have you been in current address? We'll say. Just say five years. Five years, sure. Man, writing left handed is hard. Do you have something against left handed writers? Um, Cheetah's yeah. left handed. Now I got a beef with Manning. Personal contact in case of emergency. I want all. Who's that guy? <laughs> Chris Georgia, I can't believe you just said that. <laughs>Hi, happy Halloween. We're here at Dustin's Nursery in Encinitas, California to try and find a pumpkin to carve and put out on the doorstep so when little kids come they'll have something to break and throw all over the street. All so right. we're, gonna, we're gonna take a look at some stuff. Whee! Whee! <laughs> scary face. I want little kids to crap their pants when they walk up to my front door. Mm -hmm. This one's your basic $15 model right here. This is a pumpkin 2000. <laughs> ah, this is a pumpkin. This, this, is, is, the the, new, this is the new pumpkin 2.5 series. Maybe he's falling in love with it. It's, it's possible we might have found a pumpkin. I love you. Bye. Tom. Wait, you don't want Tom part of this process? I can't see Stop <laughs> spending money! <laughs>
We are now in Mark Hoppus's house, and we are a few minutes away from carving all the pumpkins and having a really fun time. I never eat the seeds. Atticus, she's just dumb, so watch this. Atticus, come here. She, let's see if she understands English. Atticus, sit. Or beg. We won't teach you to shoot beg. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you idiot! I know, it's a little scary. Alright, well, we're done carving the pumpkins, and if you come out here, you can see them in the dark. The sky's here. Cheetahs. Very nice. Newport Beach, California, here at the Virgin Mega Store to sign copies of the book, Tales from Beneath Your Mom. The book written by my sister, credited to Blink 182. Hoppus's sister, though I prefer to think of myself as my own person. And uh, we're here tonight because we're going to sign copies of the official Blink autobiography, Tales from Beneath Your Mom. And who I did. Ah. But that's... Are you proud? I'm very proud. That's me. Yes, yes, yo. This is grabbing something down there. I'm trying to find my gun. Hello there. I was really car sick on the way down here. I threw up Taco Bell. And, uh, and took a bunch of dry meat and laid down sweating. I was green as a fucking piece of cheetah poop. Feeling better now though. Go. I got a birthday card for my mother signed. I got my book signed. And I got Tug Travis. I got my book signed too. I got this signed. I think it's signed. Oh, they did a story. They were really nice. They met them before. I gave Travis a hug. Oh yeah, it was cool. Yeah, they were really nice. Yeah, they were really nice. Oh, uh, you're fucking dead. You are dead. I'm trying to find my gun. Hi, uh, it's Mark here, and uh, I have a message from Blink-182 to the people in Europe and people in Alaska, and that is that we're sorry that we had to cancel the tours and the shows, but uh, Tom's back is really, really fucked up. He has two herniated discs in his back, uh, is what the MRI showed about two weeks ago when we canceled the tour. And uh, he's in a lot of pain. 
and we're trying to figure out what's going on right now. I wish I had an answer for you as to when we're going to reschedule or when we're going to be back, but we won't know for a couple weeks until Tom goes back to his doctor and, and uh, gets an update. But I uh, just wanted to let you know that we're sorry that we had to cancel the tours and the shows, and we're going to be back soon as we can. And we love you guys, and I want to make love with everybody out there in ways that are probably illegal in most of the countries except Germany. And, you know, we hope that Tom gets better, but at the same time, we have to make fun of him for the way that he looks. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. So we'll keep you informed. Sorry it's taking us so long to get this up on the site. You know, let's all just take a minute to reflect on the things that we do have. Like, I don't know, what do we have, Cheetah? Well, um, we have our arms and our legs and our health. And Some of us, yeah, you we're know, you know those of us that are healthy. Are you, are you playing? Are you? I mean, are you like you know keeping the licks going or anything? I've been writing some new songs lately. I've been uh, just, just give us some lyrics for one of the songs. I got, I got this one that goes, baby. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'm writing new songs. Yeah, and uh, just pull them for my friend. You know, my poor friend Tom. Right. Well, and, he'll get better. I mean, you know, if he if he does have to have an operation on his back. That I think they should go in and uh, just give him that sex change he's been looking for. I mean, he'll be under already, you know. Might as well just give him the give him the vagina that he's been wanting for the last couple of years. Baby! And what are you going to do today? Oh, uh, today? <laughs> yeah, I mean, let's let's see what Mark's schedule is yeah. during the day. Well, let's see. You know, today I have to go play golf. <laughs> you have to. I, I need to go play golf today, so I think I'm going to go play golf. And I'm not good at it, but I'm going to play at a really nice course, and somebody else is going to pay for me. It's a nice day. This is Cheetah's nice pool here. Sometimes it's warm, sometimes it's cold, but the jacuzzi is always warm. Let's see. Oh, that's very cool. <laughs> I knew you were going to try and show me these. Oh, it looks like someone's just jacuzziing earlier. Ooh. Or they were cleaning it if you were to look exactly where all the water is. Or maybe somebody drowned and they had to throw in the, uh, the <laughs> ring. Well, I guess that's it, you know? song we wrote for you guys. Wanna hear it? Here it goes. It's about my testicles! <laughs> My son. I know. Wait. Hey, I love Blink. I swear to God, I do. That's why I am, I'm here to see him. And I, I'm uh, actually naked. Uh, I have no pants. Don't pan down. I'm, I got my signal all scrambled. No, you can't see my whole thing. I don't want you to see my package. But I run through the streets naked, just like Blink. And you sing Blink songs all the time. I sing Blink songs all the time, and I blink a lot. So thanks, man. I gotta go. Sing a song, but don't make me do that. No, you don't want to hear me sing. Not with this voice. But, no, I'm okay. I'm okay. But I do love Blink. Nice, nice. Swear to God. Okay. <laughs> Thank you.
respect this guitar. Respect this. Wanna hear a song? Part to start crying and just like <laughs> cool. we have names, you know. Action. Hey, Blink 182, you can crank it up. We have names, you know. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Man, I don't know. It doesn't sound like us anymore. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Cut. Sound like us anymore. <laughs> and uh, just like do it as big as we. Can. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. More pissed off. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Uh, even angry. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. One more time. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Cut. Travis, we want you, we want you to yell at us. Really? Yeah. Yep. We want you to yell. <laughs> Cause think, try, just, man. think I'm the man. I don't okay. think I've ever heard Travis yell on his yeah, I don't really. <laughs> you have to like hit me or something to get me really mad. I'm not. I'm willing to try to do it. <laughs> Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Again? Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Scream it. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Come on, man, one more time. <laughs> Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Twice as loud. Dude, you've been saying that ever since we were Blink 12. Cut. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Come on, sweetie. Tell us where we are. 
Inglewood, California, baby. Travis Rocks. Fucking kicks ass. Are you guys excited for the show? Hell yeah. yeah. Did you see last year's show at all? No, no, man. Yeah. Yep. What, what are you looking forward to? Uh, the music. Travis drum. Yeah? Yeah, last time I saw Travis, uh, he broke his arm before the concert and I missed uh, it, so it sucked. Right, right, right. <laughs>
but I want to talk about what's going to happen tomorrow. Now tomorrow, when you guys go home, and you pick up tomorrow's newspaper, and you read the review of tonight's show, it's probably going to say that all that Blink-182 did was get up on stage and say a bunch of bad words and say a bunch of stupid jokes and pretty much offend everybody that came to the MCI Center tonight. And they're right. And they're right. But just so you know, when you read that review, this right here, this is the song they're talking about. And it goes like this. Till the sun may rise And did he look into your eyes And ask you to forget him Stick a finger or two in your eyes He is a total asshole Grandpa is a total asshole Who would ever want a dirty greasy finger in his He rolls it to a broken glass Thank you! He rubs it broken, broken glass. Thank you! Thank you so much! Hey, 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 hey. hey. It's okay, go down. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. Tell us about the baby. Give us a little baby. I just had a baby. And today I was holding her and she's pooping all over me. Really? Yeah. Her name is Ava. She's gorgeous. My wife's gorgeous. She made a gorgeous baby. I didn't really have anything to do with it. All I had to do was this. And that's all I had to do. Oh, she doesn't like it. That's too cool. There you go. Her name is Ava. She's gorgeous. There you go. What a bag. What a bag. That's a good face. Life has changed a lot since the first Urethra Chronicles video. This is Travis. I am Tom DeLong, but it should be DeLonge, because I went to France and they said, you're pronouncing it wrong, I'm all DeLong. They're not like, no, it is uh, DeLonge. My name's Mark, I ride a scooter. I'm badass. Yeah, see, how do you like it, the camera? <laughs> yeah, how do you like it? Yeah, oh, you know. yeah, how do you like it? <laughs> 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 Young and stupid Left wide open Hearts are wasted Lives are broken I like Cadillacs, I like music I don't know, I don't look too far ahead I look maybe like two months ahead I'm kind of like, uh, live fast, die fun. I hope to God we don't fucking die. I hope he dies. Get rid of hunger and some offers too. 
I want to find some poontang. I want to find some poontang. I saw this man get rid of hunger and so bonkers too. Hold up. I saw this man. You guys aren't bringing any uh, alcohol or paraphernalia into the venue, are you? All right, have fun at the fair. This is a 21-year-old face. Okay, let's go over to me. A little different. And now, you guys are in for a quite a surprise. You thought he was bad. You thought I was bad. <laughs> but there's one more to this trick. Hold on. Dun dun sh dun 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 dun. That's right, people. <laughs> this is the face of defeat and despair. <laughs> Hold on, let me do a close up. Boss, come on up. Your plan for today was to uh, to go to one of those places where you build your own teddy bear. <laughs> build a bear? <laughs> and build a bear, and then uh, have some contest where a kid gets to win the bear that we made. And I didn't think that was a cool idea. If you want to go build a bear, we can go build a bear. There's one right down the street. Is there really? Yeah. Let's go build a bear. All right, we'll go build a bear. <laughs> <laughs> what I thought was a build a bear was actually a color me mine. Pottery painting place. Have we done that before? I've never done that before. Is that the call? We're going to uh, Color Me Mine, three grown men. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll find Chris a girlfriend at the Color Me Mine place. Do single women hang out at the Color Me Mine, paint pottery? We're about to find out. Hey, we're gonna go paint some pottery, dude. I'm gonna paint something for your mom. <laughs> Do it, show, show the air. She wants to buy you cheetah boxes for her. I have a for crush Chris George and his mom. I've got all kinds of stance, stencils. I've got idea books if you want to copy designs from those too. And I can show you how to transfer those. Wow. Alright. And anything you paint today, you get back on Friday. They're cheetahs. Are good. Okay. Wait, today's Sunday. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> there you go. We gotta get some people to paint with us. Put that thing down. Here, you put it down. <laughs> huh? Hey, this is fucking lame, dude. This is <laughs> fucking lame. What was my idea? Maybe it was to go sneak into Harry Potter. Yeah. Okay, right now we're three grown men and we're standing in the middle of the movie theater and we have no idea what to do. We really don't know what we're doing right now. Can you take us a tour, on a tour of your place? They want a tour. I think they want a little ice cream though. Yeah. She said no? Vanessa! Is it? Okay, here we go. Ready? We got it. I think the dance you hate that? <laughs> Can I sing a song? Yeah. I have to get like a trailer and like a bunch of equipment and computers. <laughs> <laughs> a chocolate chip. One chocolate chip. I can't do it with Nelly playing. It's, just, it's like. You turn it down. <laughs> yeah. Would you like to serenade us? <laughs> no, no. I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> Time to go. Bye. <laughs> jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Hi, this is Tom from Blink 182. Merry, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. I hope Santa Claus gets you everything you want and everything you deserve. <laughs> Greetings, citizens of planet Earth. My name is Mark, and I play in a band called Blink-182. My wish for you is to have a pleasant, pleasant holiday season and a very happy new year. Greetings to all. Now say what you really want to say. Merry fucking Christmas! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> okay, what's wrong with me? Hey, this is T. Ra. Bis from Blink182, and I want to wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy Freaking New Year. Nice! Tattoos? New ones. New ones. Oh my god! New Whoa!
I think I'll be all right. All the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Since we've got no place to go, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Does hey, this is T. Rare. This from Boxcar Racer, and I want to wish you a happy fucking holiday. Hey, what's up? This is Dave from Boxcar Racer, and uh, I'm here to wish you a very happy holidays. Hey, this is Anthony from Boxcar Racer, and I want to wish you a very happy holiday. Cool. Now do it one more time, some, somehow different. Um, Merry Christmas from Anthony from Boxcar Racer. Hell yeah. Hi, this is Tom from Boxcar Racer, and happy holidays, and I hope that it's the best holiday you ever, ever had. And I hope that the elves come and they sneak into your room and go, ooh, gobble, gobble, gobble on your penis. As you love me so, let it snow, let it snow, let it snow. Girls haircut though. Here we go now to the south side. That looks like a girl's haircut though. second day it's very early you should put Vaseline on your thighs <laughs> you should probably put it on for me yeah how come I have to wear the banana suit and nobody else did the way we're going I couldn't figure out how to use that thing so I couldn't tell like which way if we're going north south east west northeast southeast south west east and north I think Eminem makes a way hotter chick than I do what about me man I thought I was pretty hot you're, you're pretty good with the ass like, hanging out like, I like butt that crack. yeah Chicks love when like a dude's butt cracks just totally hanging out of the pants. I think pretty much anything Eminem does is cooler than what we do. It's because you have a crush on him. So? It doesn't change the fact that he's cool. I don't like me, and no, I don't know you don't like me either. I don't know if you saw all the sex that just walked by. What do you have to say about me not having the sound turned on for the first hour on the, on the, on the camera? <laughs> turn on the sound. Yeah. And, uh, have you shot anything in the last three hours, I think? No. I tried to walk in the bar right now. Yeah, they happened? wouldn't let me in. They wouldn't let you into the club? Uh -uh. Why not? I don't know. They said I, I didn't have ID because I on my wall with me, so they can't, I can't I can't go in there. And I said, well, we have, we're filming a video. He said, no, you're not. Yeah, how come I have to wear the banana suit and nobody else did? I 
See a transvestite? <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, my name is Mark. I, I fuck. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Yes.